got here, what, seven minutes late? Seven minutes late, big old line. This is what it is, dude. Got here late, did get here late. People looping the line already. Gotta get into arguments with people because people trying to cut, you know, you know, stuff you gotta deal with. All right, all right, by the time I got up front, all they had was a nine. Dude, I don't need a nine. Dude, I'm so annoyed. All resellers. And um, yeah, we're gonna talk about that because I don't even blame them, but there was bullshit. Um, yeah, I almost started to fight with someone. Bullshit, but it is what it is. Yeah, but I, that's what I get for coming here late. I had to do something with my kid and life gets in the way sometimes, but I did want to show you guys. Definitely possible that it wasn't hard to get. There were at least 40 people in line in front of me. Pretty much everybody got a pair. Um, all the resellers got the bigger sizes, but uh, they were available, were available. So that's kind of why I wanted to make this video for y'all. This is the Jordan wall right here. Not, not that many Jordans to be really honest. Not that many retros. Um, I do need to make a return at Shoe Palace anyways too. So it, it is all gonna work out, but yeah, kind of annoyed, kind of annoyed. They doing retros of all the Currys right now? Got Curry 4s right here? Okay, okay. Golden State Warriors colorway, of course. Another one of the 4s right here. We just saw a bunch of 2s and stuff like that earlier today. We got the 11s going for 160, 130 for the 2s. And even the 4s, holy cow. I had to look them up. I don't know all the Currys like that. Yeah. Got a bunch of different Currys. Retroing all of them at the same time. That's an interesting interesting way to do it checking out the nike basketball stuff now this is fire dude gt jumps twos right here these this is such a dope colorway such a dope have i seen i want to say i think i've seen this one the like the, the clear store the nike outlet's one of them buck 80 for this this is one of my favorite colorways of these they really do have the best collection around of nike basketball like haven't really seen that at too many places Seen them here and there, but not too crazy. They have colorways haven't seen before. I've not seen these GT Cut 3s right here. Seen a couple here and there, but haven't seen all these colorways like, like this right here. The uh -huh. Force 88s right there. GT Cut 2s. Another one of the GT Cut ASWs. I haven't seen that. Yeah, I'm good. Thank you. Got these bad boys right here. These are the GTs right the the Zoom GTs, right? Yeah, man. I've not seen these. I've seen them online, but I haven't seen them anywhere. But they do got them here. Do got them here. I, like, I love the Air Moab Temple stuff, but I don't like it when they put it on everything. Like, like yeah, I'm good on these. Also got these right here as well. Another one of the GT Jump 2s. That's a pretty dope colorway as well. They do have a separate women's section in the back. Sneakers-wise, not really seeing too many crazy things or like really good sales items. Do you got certain things, like certain house brands on sale, like sports bras for 10 bucks? Oh, that's pretty cheap. Uh, I don't really know the brand and stuff, but normally 35 down to 10. Cozy, they got tights and stuff like that for 10 bucks. Different colorways too, I guess. $20 hat section, got some decent hats. Look at the new era snapbacks, Chargers hats right here, but I not seen too much variety. Oh, got one of the Dodger hats right here in an interesting colorway. That's a pro standard hat right there. Ram snapbacks right here. I'll go for 20 bucks, not bad. These are new era hats, so not too bad. Newer, what is this, the two ways? The latest version of the two ways right here. Guess they're getting better. I guess they're getting more interesting or more of a modern look. But literally none of the 574s on sale. None of the New Balance on sale. This is insane. This is insane. Just got one, 550, all regular price. Wow. And of course, you have all the attractions out here. You got people you can take pictures with, that type of stuff. You got um, you got a fake Barbie, and then you have a la lady with a snake over there. You have the El Capitan across the street, Jim and Kimmel show right there. And then all this mess right here, all the tourists, they even have a little deal or no deal TV show. I guess you go. Do your thing and see if you can win something. Okay. okay. All right, I did walk back to my car. I need to make a return at Shoe Palace. So I'm gonna take care of this. Let's go. Got a little Hollywood sign. You guys need to take a picture of the Hollywood sign. Construction here finally done. They got all kinds of activities for the kiddos while we go shop. Okay. 
All right, now we are at Club Shoe Palace. There's loudest music around. All right, I did make the return. I am coming downstairs. Remember, Shoe Palace, you get 14 days to get a full refund or I think 30 days for store credit, I believe that's their rule. I was seeing if they have any dope Reeboks on clearance. No, not really, because they always have Iversons and stuff like that on sale. Shoe Palace has been giving out really good discounts on the Reeboks, just getting rid of them super quick. And they do have new balances right here. Nothing on sale though, man. They got their own clothing on sale, Back to the Future merch and stuff like that. All downstairs though, which is surprising. A lot of people don't even come downstairs, so I am surprised that it's all downstairs. They do have the Crocs on sale. These are the new or Crocs. I don't know the name of the different Crocs, but but yeah, they do have those. But yeah, thirty dollars for these. These are normally like seventy or something like that. And then the regular ones are still regular price. Yeah, they're still regular price. They have the Jeremy Scotts here. I haven't really seen these anywhere. These are Jeremy Scott's or is this somebody else now? I don't know. But yeah, Jeremy Scott did this a way back when. Yeah, yeah, Jer Jeremy Scott's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's interesting. They're all patent leather this time. Oh, I forgot to tell you that's the price. $220 for those. Damn, no sales tags or anything. I know. They're trying to. Oh, okay. So there are stuff on sale, just nothing is marked because this is like a hype location. But yeah, these are going for $80, the Gazelles, 100 for these, 100 for these, 100 for those right there. Dan Smith's going for $100. Yeah, those are on sale, 50 bucks for these right here. Okay, okay, so they do have stuff on sale. Our Jordan section up top and pretty much the same stuff that we've seen everywhere else. Wait, not really. They do got these, I haven't seen these anywhere else. These are the Jordan Hydro 4 reimagines. And this is this part. Wow, it's actually buck leather and stuff. This is dope, dude. I've, I have the white ones. I do not have these. I have the white ones from like, what, five years ago or something like that. Yeah, and $65, super, super dope. I do have quite a few that match the shoes that I have and stuff. Uh, kind of dorky, but uh, I like them. I like them. $65 worth like? I don't know. And they do have sales, they just don't have all the sales tags. Some of them do, some of them don't. These are going for 140 right here. 100 for those, we've seen these. Like, price is kind of the same everywhere. All the shoe palaces are pretty uniform. They do have a nice little soundtrack here. Got, uh, I think it's, I think it's like custom remixes or something, but yeah, 180 for those. Yeah, this is a weird color combination right here. 125 for these, super plasticky. But you know, not too too expensive, I guess. The women's section still got, damn, still got these for retail. That is a hell of a surprise. One eighty for those still. These are one eighty two. They might be mismarked. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if those are mismarked. Still got these as well. Dunk low twist right here. One twenty five in the women's. One forty for those. The quarter war bad boys right there. Air Max one. Go for eighty dollars. That's not bad. Eighty bucks right here. Air Max ninety is going for a hundred. And then these are going for 80 as well. Oops. We're gonna, we're gonna throw that back right there. Okay, cool. I think we're at them. All right, I think that's it. I think that's it. Um, let's go home and talk. Let's go talk. All right, so it is the end of Sunday. And uh, yeah, this was my original pair. Did pick this up at Shoe Palace. Did uh, finally win one of the raffles. But, um, but yeah, I did get another pair today. One of my boys did call me and he was able to help me out with one of these. That's just why you gotta get to know people, you know? But uh, but yeah, was able to get one of these. I did try to get a size 11, uh, like you guys saw in this video. I was trying to get a size 10 and a half, I mean. I was trying to get a 10 and a half. I was trying to help one of my boys out who wears a 10 and a half. But uh, yeah, obviously that didn't work. By the time I got to the front uh, at Foot Locker, they only had up to size nine, and I, I really didn't feel like um, size swapping with the size nine, because I know it wasn't gonna be super easy. So uh, yeah, size. 11 gonna do a side swap with one of my boys um but yeah man let, let, let's talk about let's talk about the entire release and stuff all right guys let's talk about these jordan 4 bread reimagines aka jordan 4 black cements right for all the og collectors people have been saying the resale dead dude and and uh for the most part um yeah resale has fallen off but something you guys need to realize is for certain releases, there's gonna be resale, 
and you're gonna have to work with some urgency, man. Uh, these were not that hard to get, but if you didn't like go to the right spot first thing in the morning, they weren't easy. They weren't easy because uh, things started selling out super quick. Um, the leftovers, they, they went super quick. Um, yeah, I got there seven minutes late and I, I wasn't able to get my size. So uh, y'all y'all saw that. Um, whenever anything has resale, you guys do have to act with a sense of urgency. Because right now there's really not that much with resale. You know, the Kobe's, the super OG um, Jordan releases, that, that's pretty much about it. You know, maybe some SB Dunks, some collabs. But, um, but you know, it's definitely not every Jordan release. So... Um, you know, you, you, whenever there is something with resale value, you kind of have to act quick. You pretty much need to be out there, and you need you need to you need to make it happen. You need to make it happen. Um, th there's trends that are developing. A lot of the Nike stores, including the community stores, um, they've been having stuff. They've been having um, a lot of the Jordan releases. Uh, you guys saw my video. If you guys have been watching for a while, uh, the the Jordan 4 Red Cements, uh, the Kobe's, like they've been having a ton of releases lately, especially like the really uh, exclusive releases or the really uh, high demand releases. They've been having them. So, um, you know, if you, if you if you need something, you can hit up one of those spots first thing in the morning. Um, but uh, but yeah, definitely um, it that definitely wasn't hard. But the later on during the day, it, it got tougher and tougher. And then uh, now. Um, you know, um, it's, it's not going to be easy. Resale's actually gone up on these. Resale's actually gone up uh, during, I think during, like, on release day, it was like 250 260 and now they're close to 300 a little over 300 stuff. So, um, you know, uh, I don't really want to talk about resale stuff, but uh, that's a good barometer on how tough a sneaker's going to gonna be to get, you know, whether you get it on release day, whether you get it after, because um, if there's going to be re-releases and late shipments, that type of stuff, um, people are going to be on them. People are going to be on them because there is resale. Um, you know, um, I, I can't really blame the resellers because there's really not much else. Um, you know, so 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 it is what it is. That that's kind of how the sneaker game is. Uh, you know, you can like it, you can hate it, you can respect it, whatever. But that's it is what it is, man. It is what it is. So uh, there's really not much, not much that can be done. So um, you know, hopefully you guys are able to get your hands on them. Um, I think I'm going to be able to get a ten and a half with my size eleven. I'm pretty sure. Um, I might be able to work something out tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys, uh, hopefully you guys saw my, some of my older videos where I talked about it. I, I meant to get a Jordan Four um, Jordan Four release video out on like Monday or Tuesday, but I uh, wasn't able to. wasn't able to because life got in the way. Um, yeah, my work has been crazy. I've been working crazy hours, and uh, yeah, life life just gets that way. But uh, but yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. Hopefully you guys were able to get one. Um, yeah, man. Like, like these were dope, dude. These were dope. I might do a comparison video this week if I'm able to with the, um, you know, the old, older pair. Twenty, was it 2018, 2019? I don't remember. But, uh, but yeah. Hopefully, you guys. Um, hopefully, you guys can watch out for that. But, uh, but yeah, got plenty, plenty coming. Um, you know, I, I did go to San Francisco this past weekend, so I'm gonna uh, get a bunch of videos, and you guys should be seeing those throughout the rest of this week. And that's pretty much about it. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for making it to the end. Uh, definitely appreciate each and every one of you guys that do support the channel. Make sure you help a boy up. Make sure you press that like button if you're new. Subscribe. And but that's pretty much about it, man. Uh, let me know what, what you guys think in the comment section. Um, and yeah, I got plenty coming. See you guys next one. Peace.